Reactions intensifying. Wisconsin Attorney General Josh Call says he wouldn't enforce Wisconsin's ban on abortions if justices overturn Roe v. Wade. 12 News Matt Smith tonight on the new uncertainty that brings. That march and rally ongoing tonight. This is new questions arise this evening about whether Wisconsin's law would be enforced if the Supreme Court overturns Roe v. Wade. Democratic Attorney General Josh Call tonight doubling down. Are you saying that you won't enforce or you won't follow state law? Wisconsin's 19th century law that would go into effect bans doctors from performing abortions in the state. Doctors potentially facing a felony if they do so, up to six years in prison and a $10,000 fine. We always follow state law. What, what I'm saying is that um, we conduct investigations. We sometimes prosecute cases as special prosecutors. Uh, and it's my view that it would be a misuse of our resources. Call is facing re-election this fall. His Republican opponents tonight on the attack. What would be your approach? We're going to enforce the rule of law. If that means prosecutors as attorney general, if they need guidance or support, we're going to provide that. Initial charges would be up to local district attorneys, specifically in Dane, Milwaukee and Sheboygan counties, home to Wisconsin's four abortion clinics. Milwaukee County District Attorney John Chisholm telling the Journal Sentinel there's still too many unknowns to determine how he would approach the issue. I certainly expect that we will see legal actions being filed uh, relating to what the, the state of the law is because uh, again, we're really in uncharted territories here. Tonight, Sheboygan County's district attorney telling me he has made no determinations as well and will begin having those what if conversations in the coming days. In Milwaukee, I'm Matt Smith, WISN 12 News. Right now, the State Justice Department is determining whether it would sue to prevent Wisconsin's law from taking effect.